Oh baby. Oh baby. I think X is going to tell us, but if he doesn't, I will in a moment. <laughs> Yeah, it's a panthera. You bet it's a panthera. Let's do a slow roll. Let's go let's go counterclockwise. Yeah, the panthera is a nice nice ride. This is a place called I don't even know how to pronounce it, so I probably shouldn't attempt. But this is Arhus. Ar Arhus. Uh, otherwise known as Echo Kilo Alpha Hotel. Echo Kilo Alpha Hotel. And uh, it's in, it's in, uh, does anyone recognize those names? <laughs> it's in uh, Denmark. It looks pretty. Never have I been here in the simulator. So E-K-A-L slash A-A-R. Yep, Denmark. So I kind of want to live, I want I want to buy one of those homes over there off of the runway. I think that would be pretty cool. Anyway, that is that. We can take just a quick gander around. Uh, the thing I love about European X-Plane is that it has the European style buildings now, right? So that's a very European looking situation there. Oh, snack. Four. We gotta subscribe. Four months. We gotta subscribe. Thank you for the sub, Mr. X. Sir X. X himself. Thank you for the subscribe. So we gotta subscribe. I appreciate all the sub sounds. Any one of you guys who are subs, see look at that's kind of cool. It looks like it's on both sides of the airport. So yeah. Yod78, good morning. You've heard of it? Okay. Those aren't houses. They're hangars for military aircraft. Are you serious? Are you talking about over here or the ones that I was pointing to over over there? Those were residential Yo, houses. Yo, John Fly, acknowledge the follower. Thanks for the follow, Test Flight 357. All right, so these are military hangars? Are you kidding me? Well, that's that's a residence right there, right? That's got to be. These look too too much like, you know what? These look like office buildings. Yeah, these look like office buildings. So it looks like I can't. That could be a military aircraft, right? I guess that's pretty cool. Separated to make sure you can't hit them all at the same time. Okay, I like that. That's pretty cool. Thank you for the subscribes and the follows. That's pretty good. All three of those loops are hangers according to Google. Okay. Thank you, Armchair Aviator. Appreciate that. Boshini97, hello. <sighs> yes, miles ahead. My shirt is almost invisible again. And in circum certain circumstances, you will see right through me. <laughs> All right. So in this plane, we got to... I did it again. I forgot to switch the default sound. To bummer. I'm going to do it now so I don't forget the next time. Uh, does that set my default sound? I wish that... I, I'm going to have to just talk to, to Laminar and say, Hey, Laminar, make it so we can reset our sound card in X-Plane without having to relaunch the sim. Because I forget to take it over to the streaming PC, the audio. All right, let's grab the key. Boop. Key's in there now. I forgot how to start this plane, so. Uh, oh, there's such good sounds here also. All right, we got one people, two pieces of luggage. Let's load up, some, we'll load up some fuel. Take the chocks off. Looks good. Good morning, Steve-O99. You can hear it? 
Well, yeah, you can hear it through my microphone, right? So it's it's not pay, playing through the streaming PC, unfortunately. Like if I, yeah, it's going it's going through this microphone from my speakers. <laughs> so on the next uh, launch of X Plane, which I usually do in between two different airplanes, I will uh, I'll get the sound going. So if I sound a little bit um, master power on, I guess. What, fuel pump on, maybe? I forget the order of this. Avionics on. Um, if, I found, if I sound a little, like, you know, tired, it's because I am. I, was, uh, I had a merry old time uh, last night with, um, with some friends. Um, and... Uh, some of them are here in chat, so if they want to speak up and and uh, comment on our our little bit of uh, a fun night, that was a good time. Good good movie. Good 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 uh, grub. Really good grub and good uh, grog. <laughs> uh, am I planning on shaving? Uh, I think I will shave on stream, but I may shave off, I may shave off stream and then come back shaving. Or I guess I could do it live, but should we do it live? I guess we could have a vote. Uh, let's see if the engine will turn on. Uh, fuel pump is on. We got a subscribe. Oh, we got a subscribe. The alerts. Oh, uh, test flight 357. Can you, thank you very much for the subscription. We got a subscribe. Can you refresh your screen, refresh the web browser, and then click the share button, please? So refresh the web browser and click the share button because I want to rock the Invisistics. Sometimes, for some reason, um, the alerts aren't working until someone refreshes. I hope they fix that. Now right, let's come down here. Do we go full prop on this? I can't remember. Full mixture, and we'll try it. Sounds pretty good to me. But thank you very, oh, there we go. Just saying Man United for Life. P. Man United for Life works for me. Thank you for the subscription, Testlight357. Thank you for allowing uh, me to rock the Invisistics. Welcome to the Snack Shack. All right. I think we uh, are good to go here. Mr. Virus City, how are you doing, sir? I gotta play this song, dude. You've gotta hear this song that was created by WTF thirteen ten. It is unbelievable. What does the servo elevator fail mean? Is that a bad thing? Oh, does that mean this isn't on? Maybe. Okay. Yeah. 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 All right. Let's squawk. Uh, let's squawk twelve hundred. Let's go back here. Transponder code. Uh, one. We got a subscribe. Oh, we got another subscribe. Oh, snack. We got a sub. Got a subscribe. Wave those sticks some more. Wave those sticks some more. Thank you, NY Kev, for the subscription. Appreciate the support. Love rocking the Invisi sticks. All right, let's go one. To. Actually, what's the squat code in Europe? I forget. What is this? 7,000. That's right. 7,000. All right, we're squawking altitude. Uh, what else do we want? Oh, I want my altimeter. My altimeter is 2,902. Okay, 7,000. Okay, cool, cool. All right, let's release the parking brake. Uh-oh. My uh, my MFG crosswinds feel a little bit bizarre. Let's 
Gotta turn the nose wheel steering on. No? Something doesn't feel right going on here. Do I always have my fuel pump on in this plane? Oh, that's really bizarre. So one of my... I'm not getting any... Um, yeah, I got an engine problem here. On the gins. Oh, I know why. No. All right, guys. I don't know this plan that well. I'm not going to lie. Fuel looks good. Master's on. Something's going on with the engine. You guys have any clue? Something did something fail? Doesn't look like any ox is the GPU. Okay, I don't need that then. I guess I do need my taxi lights on. Is that recog is taxi? Yeah, I okay. Steve zero nine nine Q and H. Yeah. Q and H is two nine or nine or two right now. Um we got a sub crash. I could change it to millibars, but what, right now I got an engine problem. It's really bizarre. It's on the right fuel tank. What do you guys think that is? Like right there, it's showing yellow. Is there an alternator anywhere? This is bizarre. I might have to reload the plane. I don't show any... Nothing there. All right, well, we'll reload and see what happens. Did you get do you guys have any clue what happened there? It's weird. All right, let's reload. Actually, we'll just It's weird. Weird gives me a chance to sip my coffee, though. Yeah, it's really interesting. Taking it sweet time. We may get sounds after all. Where in here do I switch from, from, uh, you know, what would it be? It's millibars to what? When I go to European, the Q and H, not the, uh, the altimeter setting. I think, I think she's 
Yeah, she's not happy. Well, that's unfortunate. It's okay. It's okay, we'll get sounds now, right? Hectopascals or something, I think. Nice to see you in Europe, John. Keep up the good work. Flybad64. Flybad64 with a subcribe. We got a subcribe. Thank you for your support. I'm ha I'm really pleased to be in Europe. It's it's beautiful. It's just a beaut and and the thing is, I'll let we you in on a little subscribe. secret. Thank you for rocking the sub sounds. We got a little uh, a little secret here. Flybad64 is I'm actually running the European Ortho. Um, half of my European Ortho is on a USB drive, a USB hard drive connected to my SIM, and that's why it takes a while to load. <laughs> uh, the other half of it. So you take the um, 48th parallel, the 48th parallel all the way down to the 27th parallel is on the uh, hard disk and then the 49th parallel up to like the 72nd par parallel up there the very tip top of Sweden and Norway is uh, on uh, USB hard drive but it's working hello Wayne 7154 I Ten thirteen point two is two nine nine or two in millibars. Okay. Yeah. So this this load does take a little while when we're loading up in northern Europe, but it's worth the wait. What's new, Mr. Wayne? What's new, Gavin? And I, Gav B. How's your weekend been? Almost there. I have no idea what, what happened with that engine. No idea. Oh, it didn't work. Let's try it again. Oh, key's already in. Uh, what's A and C? Is that air conditioning? I think I might have to get a new capture card because that crackle is kind of annoying. Yeah, the sounds are loud now. My engine's better. My engine's happy. Let's go find a runway. Let's go fly around Denmark, shall we? What's the plan route? I don't know. I think I'm going to get up in the air. I'm going to fly over to the coast. And then after the coast, I'm going to pick, go to my GPS and I'm going to pick just an airport to go fly, do a low approach, touch and go. I don't know. We'll play it by ear. The engine sounds rough though. It's really weird. Put my uh, transponder on altitude. I'm 
We've got a playroom that way. Playroom that way. How come I got no speed tape? Oh, there we go. It takes a while to get to get it registered. Okay. My engine doesn't sound happy, but... There we go. Landing gear up. Landing gear up. Landing gear up. Oh, it's gorgeous. Take a look at EKYT. How far away is EKYT? I'll have to take a look at that on the GPS. We could possibly do that. My engine doesn't sound very good right now. AOW Moab Slayer, how you doing? Uh, if you choose, go to EKCH, Oral Sound Bridge. Let me see that. So EKCHEKYT and EKAH. All right, and or sorry, that's where we are. Okay. Let's uh, pop that into the GPS for a second. So we got. Uh, EKYT. I'll try that first. Oh, it's only 54 miles away. We could certainly do that. Let's take a look at this area, though. First, before we head that way. EKCH. A bit big for GA. What is EKCH? Is that Copenhagen or something? Let's see what this bird can do. Alright, let's do a low approach. 109, 200 knots right now. It's pretty good. EKYT, I was there today with your Seminole. Nice. Copenhagen, okay. Are the cow flaps open? Are there cow flaps on this plane? I didn't even know. I love that shadow. It's the fuel pump, and it's still on. Okay. So I turn my fuel pump off. What about it? Should I have my fuel pump on if I'm doing aerobatics? Maybe I should. Let's buzz. Let's buzz downtown here. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's just utterly gorgeous. Ooh, there's some canola. What is this down here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. I look like Harry Potter. And <laughs> Yeah. I, do, I need to change my... Why do I need to change my shirt? I think it looks cool. To what? What do you want me to wear? I am changing it. With every mile I fly, I'm changing my shirt today. See, right here, it's going to change a little bit even more. Woo, dog. So the question, are there cow flaps? on this bad boy and if so where are they
No coal, coal. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you were talking to someone else about the cow flaps. Let's buzz some trees. Let's see if we can go pull a maneuver. Go up. This is what Denmark looks like from the goose stash perspective. Go goose stash says this is what it look Denmark looks like. Oh, we just lost our tank. Can't go inverted for probably without the fuel pump. Let's try it with the fuel pump on though. All right, so fuel pump on. Here we go. Pick up some speed. All right, let's see if the engine stays on this way. Yep, fuel pump, she's staying on. Do I have enough altitude to do a reverse? Yes. Cool. Let's see what that car's doing. What base source or am I using for America? Um, I use like, I try all of the sources. So really, it's just it's a you know. Well, I I skip a few of them but that I that you know, I just have to skip. But yeah, you, it's just a matter of trial and error. Anyone here can pipe in what they think the best sources are. But some are newer than others. Some are not as some have more clouds than others. Yeah. All right, so now we can turn the pump off. Well, I'm still doing aerobatic. Well, I don't necessarily have to do aerobatics right now though. This is gorgeous country though, isn't it? All right, let's get up here. Let's retrim. Oh, snack, Petrie Ron says. This is the author of the ortho himself. This is this is this is actually Petrie Ron's uh this is Petrie Ron's ortho. He he's a master. He's a magician. He's a wizard. And I'm going to do a loop-de-loop -loop in his honor. Woo! That was not a perfect one but you get the idea all right let's bring up the GPS and uh, what we're gonna do is well let me put on the autopilot first okay so to do autopilot I think I go uh, here autopilot I go uh, roll I go let's go heading and then we'll go uh, pitch we'll do um, vertical speed uh, set altitude 4000 we'll go up to 4000 for now actually set altitude 3000 and then we'll and then we'll come down here to the autopilot and we'll go flight plan at a waypoint and we'll put in uh, Echo Kilo Yankee Tango put that in there in fact we'll just go direct to yo activate. John Fly acknowledge the follower um, we'll take that thank you for the follow angry whopper film we'll change uh, this CDI to GPS and then we'll go into uh, let's see the roll nav let's go to EKYT all right what else do we got here yeah I think I might go to that bridge next Wayne so that bridge is uh, is that bridge at near you said it was near Echo Kilo Charlie Hotel I gave B is giving some sources. There we go. Hello, Alex Korth. Good morning. 
The nectar of the gods. Yeah. Near EKCH. Okay. We'll do that. Okay, I'm going to turn the sounds down a bit. The engine doesn't sound right, to be honest. Sounds I gotta I gotta learn how to lean this bad boy. Alright, so if we look here at the engine, I should probably be peak do I need to be peaking my I need to probably pull back on the RPMs, huh? Or the throt. Which one? Let's see. Yeah, let's bring that one back a little bit. Into the green. And we want to stay below this red line, right? I want to get these all not being yellow. Yeah, there we go. Does that look a little healthier? The engine does sound sick. Yeah, it does. Keep them in the yellow. What we can do is switch the fuel tanks now. Not sure why your CHT is hot. Uh, hot, yeah. Uh, are the CHTs here? Yeah, CHTs are here. Maybe we should try to cool it off. That's a bad thing. EGT to the right. Okay. I need to fly this plane a little bit more, but what is this? Look at this scenery, folks. I mean, despite our engine problems, we got some nice looking scenery. Mm hmm. Yeah, I did lean the mixture, uh, Sparrow. Um, that's what brought my EGT down. But maybe I should, maybe I should bring down the mixture a little bit. Oh, they're, oh, they're starting to go yellow now. So that's good. Should I, should I go lean a peak. They're all yellow now, so that's good. I guess right there would be good for now. According to the GPS, we are... Four, uh, 46 miles to destination. Love that. <coughs> is it... it it's, is it not just... No, it's not, it's not just ortho. This is... Um, this is Denmark Pro also. So it's it's Ortho 4XP, but it also has uh, Denmark Pro, which if I'm not mistaken, and Petrie Ron can correct me if I'm wrong. I don't have the Y I don't have the Y Ortho overlay folder. I don't have am I supposed to have the Y Ortho overlay folder? Or does is the Denmark Pro essentially laying over the autogen? That's my question. What a beautiful plane. Yeah, Turbo, turbo Clag. Welcome. Our Tatarin. Lean more? Okay. All right, lean more. What am I looking for? Probably just to get those CHTs down in the down in the green maybe. Uh-oh. That's that that was shutting my plane off right there, so I don't want to do that. Okay, we'll see how that how that works. Auto gem professional, correct. Okay, plane spotting from your house is always nice. F live ATC plus flight radar. Yeah, yeah, especially. Yep. All right, I'm gonna put on a little bit of uh, temperature control. Let's go fan. No, I don't want that on. I want it on auto. This is beautiful. Look at this. Look at that. Oh. Oh, yo, John Fly. I think we'll play the, the follow. I think we'll play the new song, guys. Again, should we play the new song again? This is. Uh, I hope he shows up in chat because uh, WTF, he's here. WTF thirteen ten, dude. I have a question for you. 
have that has that has that song been played anywhere else live yet? Because if it hasn't, it needs to go on a few other streams. I know. Oh man, I, I I'm gonna. It's gonna be my. Uh, it's gonna be my intro song. So WTF thirteen ten here in the chat. Are you here, sir? I'm gonna play your song. Let's listen, folks. He made the song WTF thirteen ten. Listen closely. Name the five YouTubers that you hear in this song. Name at least. Yeah, right there. There's one of them. We gotta rewind that though a little bit. Yeah. There's five YouTubers. H has it been played elsewhere? Oh, cool, cool, cool. Who else has it? Maybe, maybe don't name them because we're trying to guess who they are. A start, uh, getting started in an X plane stream. Yeah. I Hasn't been played? Okay. I'm looking for YouTubers though, not just Twitch streamers, YouTubers. Oh, Vision Bite got it. Vision Bite gets it. Isn't it? Look at the windmills. How do I do the camera turn around? I'm holding down the control button and using the right and left arrows. There's a, a thousand JFM for uh, Vision Bite for getting all the Premier Ones in there, Steve Okanivo. Oh, listen. We're in Denmark, Nightmare. Can you feel the love of Denmark? Five Mike Whiskey.
You're you're in the, my homeland. Nice. Yeah, we're going. To, uh, we just took off from Echo Kilo Alpha Hotel, and we're flying to Echo Kilo uh, Yankee Tango. Um, whose home field was it? It was like. Uh, I think it was Nor Jesper in here in the chat. Nor Jesper's uh, home field. Man alive. Jeez, it's just a beautiful country. What a great song. Thank you, WTF1310. I just have one... Well, first off, I'm, you're going to get like a crap ton of John Fly miles right now. All right. Uh, WTF 1310. Uh, you just got 55,000 John Fly miles. I thank you so much for putting that together. I just have one question. So if I... It, it, I'm going to rock that as my intro, and I'm going to play that from time to time on the stream. But how difficult would it be to maybe get an update in July with a few more uh, cl voice clips of a few people? The same people and maybe a couple extra? How difficult would that be? Just curious. Invalid user? Oh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's see how far away we are. EG, EGTs are st or CHTs are still hot. Gonna have to practice this engine a little bit better. All right, we're 16 miles from a destination. Denmark, Denmark is the is the best of the Scandinavian countries. I don't know about that. I don't know. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to go there. Uh, it's yeah. I'm gonna have to go there and and visit to uh, visit all of them and then give you my opinion. It. Uh, I have a feeling that they all are gonna have their shining moments. But I'm like a mountain type guy, right? So I like I love the mountains. And so are there are there any mountains in Denmark? I don't even know. But I love this farmland and this countryside and I love their use of uh wind turbines and uh they're just good good people. Mhm. Mm And you own Greenland. <laughs> That's true, you do. And the, uh, I believe you own the Faroe Islands as well. Yeah, the Faroe Islands. Um, I think. No, maybe not. Maybe that's, uh, yeah, I think you do. St. Thomas was sold to the U.S. Ooh. St. Thomas has... Well, St. John has the best beach... One of the best beaches on the planet. Trunk Bay. Vangar has an interesting runway. Okay. Currently driving through France in European Truck Simulator. Nice, Virus. Um, I was thinking about... I was thinking about getting that, but someone told me to get American Truck Simulator. Faro is Denmark. Okay. W w name a couple of Denmark beers. I don't even know any, to be honest. I should, huh? Look at those. Look at that. That's just that's just gorgeous down there. Wow, 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 wow. We're not in Kansas anymore, boys, girls. ETS is better for multiplayer. Uh, how so? Like in in what way? Because it's there are more people. I understand there's more um, scenery developed for ETS, 
uh, but isn't the ATS American expanding? Like, isn't uh, this is so gorgeous? Isn't um, New Mexico coming soon? Carlsberg is Danish. Okay, I think I have had Carlsberg before. It's been a long time though. Oh yeah, baby. What city is this? Is this Alborg? Alborg. And it's just on the other side of that water, so let's go ahead and get down to altitude. Set altitude 1000. You're, I'm flying above your house right now. Well, hello, Nor Jesper. Hello down there. I'm just dropping some JFM. Dropping some JFM. There's the airport. We need to increase our vertical speed. Bring back the throttle. Yeah, we're a little high. All right, let's do some circling down here. I want to go down to this... That looks like a racetrack of sorts. All right, so let's go. Let's go here. Uh, sorry, here. Whew. Let's go look at that racetrack for a second. Yeah, a ATS is expanding. New Mexico's coming. Yeah, that's what I heard. So a little, a little but the best drinks come from Alborg. That's good to know. I must go visit. So the question I have, Nor Nor Jesper, can I crash on your floor? If I bring a sleeping bag, can I stay with you for five days, please? I promise I don't bite. There's a smokestack. There's a park. Oh yeah, baby. This is gorgeous. Mm-hmm. Flying right over Nor Jesper's house. Hello, Nor Jesper. Taborg, not a bad logger. Al Kavit is another one. Okay. You have room in the basement? Okay. You can lock me up in the basement as long as I, you let me out at least an hour a day to look at your fine country. Perfect. Okay, guys. Donation goal. I got a Tim Rodeo go donation goal still up there for some reason. I need to uh, change my donation goal to airfare to uh, Nor Jesper's house because I got accommodation paid for. I can probably mail myself some baked beans, some baked beans and uh, some uh, uh, granola bars. If I mail those ahead of time to certain strategic points along the route, I could probably survive. And then. I'm going to head, oh wow, this is cool. All right, let's go, let's go, let's do a low, let's do a low approach first. Actually, maybe we'll do a touch and go. All right. Does it look like this, Nor Jesper? We're a little fast. All right, let's cut the throttle back. We're too fast for flaps. Landing gear down. Landing gear up. Landing gear going Landing gear up and locked. 
It very well could have been a taxiway. It looks like a ta it looks like a runway to me though. We'll land on this runway. Wait, hold on. Why do they have such a big freaking? Oh, you're right. That was a that was a uh, Harrison Ford. I'm I'm not I'm not a local. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I should have surveyed the airport. Or I should have done, pulled out the chart. All right, let's go land on the proper runway. All right, what we're going to do is I'm going to come down here for a second. Hold on. Just, just one second. Okay. The bedding is now open for this landing on the runway. <laughs> the bedding is now open. You can bed as much, almost as much as you want on either um, one, two, three, four, or five. And it shows you how to do it. And basically you're betting on the landing rate. So how many feet per minute am I gonna land? So bet, and there you go, bet, you know, Wayne bet uh, that I'm gonna be under 100 feet per minute. And he bet 200 JFM, Krythors on uh, number three, which is under 120. One thing you must do is drive to Copenhagen to to Alborg so you can cross the massive bridge. Yeah, I'm gonna have to find that bridge. Where is that bridge? Oh, oh I'll, I'll we can navigate to it, right? It's not too far away, is it? Or, or maybe it is. All right, what's flaps one speed for a Panthera? Can I lower one notch of flaps at 140? Landing gear down. Get your bits in now, it's gonna close pretty soon. Get your bits in now. Nothing is far in Denmark, that's true. Getting a little slow on the speed. Chili Willies, so snack. 125 miles okay all right no more bets no more bets uh, come on come on come on come on you can do it get down get down get down oh.
116. <laughs> Good sound, Iowa Flyer. It's right off the coast of EKCH. Okay. Doing well, Chile. Having some good time in Denmark. About to go jump on PE here in a bit. Might fly to go see this bridge. I don't know. We're going to look at the... Uh, so it's uh, six miles from EKCH. Okay. EKCH. 120 miles. Maybe I'll just load up there. Let's do a quick replay of that landing. So 116 won. So option number three. Let's see who won. We had few vor few oh, about four viewers won and seven viewers lost. Ouch. How is ortho on FPS? I'm having like a pretty good frame rate. I'll have to look at it outside of the replay and see what it is. Going all in worked. How much did you get? Oh, now how much did you get? Didn't you go to long haul captain yesterday? And you, uh, yeah, you think you did, yeah. All right, let's quickly load up at uh, EK. At EKCH. So yeah, the frame rate. I'm getting thirty. 40 frames here right now. Thank you, AOW Moabs Leia. Yeah, got to start building it back up. There you go. Thanks, Al. All right. Uh, up here to flight configuration. Change location. Echo Kilo Charlie Hotel. Castrup. Or Castrup. Um... Since we're just going to go take a quick look at the bridge, we'll just load up on 2-2 two, two left. Yeah. This may not work, but I didn't see any golf courses, actually. I did not see any golf courses. i got to start thinking about PE. What am I going to do on PE? Am I going to do some FS Economy? I'm going to do a jet. I'm going to do GA. I just don't know. Uh, it's still loading. Good, good. The one problem I have is that emergency l landing that I did yesterday in the 1900 left. See, I got 2% fuel. And I'm at 0 Charlie Alpha 6. Please tell me there's a FBO here. Yes. Oh, good. I was scared there was not an FBO here. Uh, my flight. Let's go to refuel. Oh, yes. Whew. What happens if you get to a place and they don't have any fuel? MyFlightRoute.com owns this. That's classic. 
I'm going to put like 500 gallons in here. It's going to not be cheap. Aircraft owner does not have enough cash. Banking. Uh, let's go. Uh, quick transfer set cash to 10,000. And then let's go to my flight. And go refuel. Choose provider myflightroute.com. 500 gallons of fuel. There we go. She loaded. She loaded. I can get to Limburg with my passengers. Need to do that today. In fact, I'll probably do that next. All right. Uh, you came up with a fun idea for you PE guys. Oh, well, you're a PE guy also, Chili Willy. So what, what's your idea? There are two bridges, I guess. One to Sweden and uh, one to uh, on the west. It stays in Denmark. Okay. You can call me Moab or Slayer to make it shorter. Okay, I'm going to call you Moab because uh, uh, Moab is one of my favorite spots in Utah. So if you go direct to Mosin from EKCH, it, will, it should take you right over the bridge or right next to it. Essentially, it's a race. Ooh, uh, uh, an air race on PE would actually be quite entertaining if you had the same aircraft and the same weather, of course. All right, let's do menu, delete the flight plan. Let's add the Molson. Is that Mike? Oscar Sierra India November. Remember to check the fuel. Yes, exactly. A cross country, or if you wanted to do GA, you could do like Seattle to the Midwest. That'd actually be fun with some prizes. All right, 6.2 miles away. All right, we'll squawk altitude. And uh, looks good. Pilot Edge seems like very professional. What's it like for beginners? Well, the CAP program is, Jessica, is, is amazing. So let, let's just take a, a brief look at the CAT programs right if I go here to pilot edge and uh, I sign in and I go to what hold on a second uh, all right okay so over here on PE if I go to um, the cat ratings right so watch this. So your first flight, Jessica, is the Cat 1. Chili's done this Cat 1. If I go to Cat 1, it's basically a non-towered flight. You fly from Oceano County, Lima 52, to New Cuyama, uh, Lima 88. Uh, you connect to the network, and you can do uh, just traffic calls where you're not talking to the tower. All you say is, in this case, Oceano traffic, November 572 Delta X-ray, departing runway, I forget what it is at Oceano, departing runway 1, departing the pattern to the east, climbing to 3000, Oceano traffic. So right here it gives you the example. Okay, so runway 29er, right? And here's the transcript, right? You're not talking to anyone. You're on the network. You're learning how to do traffic calls, right? And then after you do that, you have there's certain things that you have to do to claim the Cat 1 credit. But then you slowly work up through these ratings, non-towered to a class delta airport. So a non-towered field, you make your traffic calls, and then when you get near, it tells you exactly how what to do and when to do it, right? It tells you to contact San Luis or San Luis Tower. Um, uh, it says here, uh, yeah, San Luis Tower, Cessna 123 Alpha Bravo, 10 miles east, full stop landing with echo, information echo for the ATIS. And the tower comes back, you says Cessna 123 Alpha Bravo, San Luis Tower, and a right base, runway 29, report 2 mile right base. So you have to understand that, you know, a right base for 29, you're going on the, you're going to come in the opposite direction of 29 on the, on the left side, and then you're going to turn right, and then right again to land 29. 
So it's really, it's really a, a great way to start the program, right? Okay, let's do this. I hope that, I hope that helps. Oh, snack. Oh, snack. Time just loves to fly. We got a sub crab. We got a sub crab. W28 with the sub crab. Thank you. We got a sub crab. Thank you very much for the sub crab. Snacky shaka. Thank you, W28. Landing gear up. Chili Willie's hacked me, huh? All right. This looks good out here. All right, let's see. Which way is our... Uh, which way is our... It's going to be six miles away, so it's pretty quick. Let's go down here and go flight plan. Flight plan. Or, sorry. Map. That's weird. It doesn't show the path. But autopilot. Let's go uh, roll. Nav. And let's go to Mos Mosin. And uh, we'll go set altitude 1,000. That's fine. And let's go um, pitch. Let's go vertical speed. Oh, how come I can't do altitude hold? Well, it's at 1,000. That's fine. All right. We don't have to go full throttle. Bring things back. CHTs look good. Except for one of them. Okay, so so this bridge is going to be up here, right? There's there's a bridge. Thank you. That is really useful. Thank you for the information. Oh, you bet. Look forward to hearing you on the network. Okay, so we're supposedly four miles away. So where is it? Is that the bridge right over there? Maybe I don't have it in the in the scenery. That's it. Okay. So is that? We got a sub crab. Oh, there it is. Okay, there it is. All right, let's fly over there. So we'll go, thank you for the subscription. We got another subscribe, I think. Yo, John Fly, acknowledge the follower. MD811000, thank you for the subscribe. Let's sync up our heading bug. We'll fly in. I'm using my side tech panel right now. Set altitude 500. Set altitude 500. Set altitude 1000. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it won't let me go down to 500 on the autopilot. Set altitude 500. Zero, zero. Nope. 50,000 feet? No. Set altitude 1000. Set altitude 1000. Alright, autopilot off. Let's go buzz the bridge. Oh, okay, there's the real bridge. Okay, I'll have to take a look at that. Yo, John Fly. Acknowledge the follower. Thank you for the follower. Mizimansky25. Appreciate the follow. What if there's any traffic on it? Oh, there is some traffic. Let's catch up with him. Wow, he's going pretty fast. Whoever he is. Is that a cop? No, it's just a van. Wow. I'm going 170. I'm finally catching him. There you go. There you go. Alright, let's go break out. Let's hit this cell tower right here. See that cell tower getting some really good phone reception right now. Whew. Whew. 
Hey, Summit's 81. How you doing? The one to Finn is much better. Yay! 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 <laughs> Thank you, Jessica, for the bits. Appreciate that. That's funny. I got the yay sound, I think, programmed in there. That's kind of funny. All right. So what we'll do is we'll come down to the GPS and we'll go back and we'll go nearest airport. Uh, we'll land at EK. No. X cheering. Yay. Thank you, Jessica. Thank you, X. Let's go ESTT direct to. Yep. And let's go uh, autopilot back on. There we go. And let's go nav. Let's go pitch, vertical speed. Thank you for the bits, guys. Yay, yay. Uh, would you show us uh, making a towel in ortho for XP? If you type in uh, exclamation ortho, uh, that's a link to a, a video. I think it's a link to a video. Can someone type in exclamation ortho? I think that's a link to the, either the forum post. I think it's to a video actually, and that shows you. He shows you how to make tiles. Cool roundabout. Ten miles away, we'll land. All right, one more bet. If anyone wants to bet, we're opening the betting um, for landing rate at uh, at this uh, airport called Echo Sierra Tango Tango. All right, X. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for the uh, for the bits. Thanks for the subscribe. Thank you for the four months. Toodles. See you. In fact, let's play a sound for X leaving the building. Let's do this, dudes. Are you ready? Here we go. In three, two, one. Yes! Go! Yes! 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 Freedom! Have a good day, X. Seven miles out. <laughs> Ciao. It, those of you who don't know, this is this is uh, where uh, X. It's where his family's from. His family's from. His father's side is from this. Uh, from this part of the world. See ya. Yeah, Moab, yep, have been. All right, we are five miles out. We got some landing rate bets going on. Get your landing rate bets in because it closes in four nautical miles. I love the, I love the visibility of the uh, Panthera. It's really, truly, uh, there's just a lot of, uh, you can see a lot. It's pretty cool. Yeah, Europe is beautiful, Wayne. Uh, it's been a while since I've been. Um, I was really fortunate to live and work in, in Europe and travel all over the entire continent and all over the UK and all over 
southern France and Monaco and Italy and Budapest, Hungary, into the uh, Czech Republic, over into Warsaw, up into Netherlands. Never did make it to Scandinavia, though, so I need to I need to get there. All right, two miles out. Betting's closing really soon. What runway do we do? We don't want to land on a taxiway, do we? Where is this airport? We're two miles away. This might be a flyover situation. Huh. Is it right on the coast? I don't see a field. Do you guys see a field? Huh. Supposedly, we're one mile away. Do this, dudes. Are you ready? Here we go. In three, two, one. Someone bought the vowel sound. Is this... I don't see an airport. Thank you for buying the Val Freedom Sound Virus City. Love it. Where is the airport? Is that behind us? That's really weird. Is that... Maybe it's a helicopter pad or something. No airport to be found. Huh. Hmm. All right, well, we got a ditch. We're going to test the aqua ability of this plane. All right, full mixture, full throttle, full everything. Autopilot coming off. Let's hit the glass. That chopper run was fun. Hey, there's some sailboats. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm just going to play that song one more time just because I love it. It's just too good. WTF 1310, thank you. And then after this song is over, we're going to Pilot Edge. Oh, more sailboats. I don't know. I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do, Virus City. I really haven't decided. I may have a vote. It's kind of a it's a dictatorship, but sometimes the dictator lets the lets the uh, the audience decide. There's a tractor. That's farm simulator. That's squirreled in the field. Thank you. 
Center, resume normal speed, climb maintained, level 230. Normal speed, climb now, level 230, climb maintained, level 190, good afternoon. Was it an A10? I don't know. Marcus. Cat Strader. Red Bull Air Race, yeah. Five, 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 whisk, five, nine, clear for takeoff. All right, clear for takeoff, runway nine, and uh, follow the short line eastbound. Five, Mike, whisk, thank you. Oh, he's coming in out of 17, 30, out of 14, point seven for one, seven, seven. Calrack, how you doing? On the deck. just ejected. Blazing it. Blazing it. All right. Cut your power. Cut your power. Cut your engines. Hide your kids. Let's see. Uh, yeah. Did I just bounce? I did, didn't I? I wish I had a shoot. No handle here. No John Fly handle here. All right, let's go to PE.